what up YouTube today's video I want to talk about how are some ways that Satan's people put curses on God's people and how can you protect yourself against these curses now uh, uh, first things first I want to say this is a subscribers request so I had to take care of this now uh, people don't know that Satan's people they do try to put curses on God's people right and depending on what spiritual protection you have you can be protected and their curses can bounce off your spiritual protection and go back and kill them yes this is true but the thing about it is if you're not protected then you will be attacked by some of these curses now this is the thing uh it's funny that uh one of my subscribers just mentioned this because i was watching uh one of Tiario videos, he was talking about that, uh, how Satan's people try to curse people. It's kind of weird how that happened. He's like, Satan's people will try to curse you. And the best way to deal with that is to curse them as well. But curse them, you know, in the name of the Most High. You know what I'm saying? He say Jesus, I say the name of the Most High. But um, this is my opinion on it, right? Uh, if you want to, first things first, I want to say this. If you want to protect yourself from Satan's people curses, first things first, you have to get you a sigil. A pyramid of protection right a period a pyramid of protection right you get you a picture of yourself hold on let me start from the beginning first you get you a notebook right draw a triangle on the notebook in the middle of that triangle draw a little circle from that from that uh, upper point draw a line from that circle to that upper point from the left side of that circle draw a line to that left corner of that triangle then from the right side of that uh, circle draw a, a line from that right side of the circle to that right point in the triangle right i mean you'll have three points going from um the top point left point to the right point right and then you draw a 13 in the middle of that circle then on top of the uh the, on like the point of the triangle you draw a 13 on the left point you draw a 13 on the right point of the triangle you draw a 13 then after that you get you a picture of yourself a lot of people like to use baby pictures of themselves that's cool but try to use a picture of yourself of the age you are now you see what i'm saying Cause it works better and then you you could glue that picture right there or you could tape it whatever you want to do put that picture right there once you put that picture right there you get you some pennies before 1982 they have to be dated before 1982 and don't try to get a penny that's 1982 it has to be before 1982 you know what i'm saying like 60s 70s those are the best kind now you're using that that's important because copper comes from the earth right copper generates energy you see what i'm saying protective energy so once you you get you three pennies, I mean four pennies, that's dated before 1982. You put one of those pennies at the top point of the triangle, and then the other three pennies you put at the bottom, making it like a triangle. And that is a pyramid of protection, and that will protect you against any curse that any Satanist or any one of Satan people try to put on you. That will protect you, real talk. Now, you're only using four pennies because you're not strong enough to use five or more. See, me, I could use way more than that because I've been doing this shit for a minute. So motherfucker try to say anything to me or do anything I don't like, energy coming back to their ass instantly. Real talk. Because I'm protected with this shit. But uh, the way that Satan people will try to put a curse on you is they will try to curse you by uh, like sending you negative energy and shit. It's like, um, for example, right? When you would know when Satan, when the Satan people try to put a curse on you is because the thoughts that you will be having they're not your thoughts you have like evil type of thoughts you know what i'm saying like crazy depressive you know what i'm saying sadistic type of thoughts those that's how you know one of the saints people have tried to put a curse on you because your thoughts and you know what i'm saying you just be thinking some real crazy shit but that's not you that's a curse that one of the saints people try to put on you you see what i'm saying to fuck up your mind so you have to use discernment to know if that satan's voice or if that's your voice or if that god voice talking to you so that's how you know if Satan's people have tried to put a curse on you, and I just told you how you protect yourself from those curses. Simple as that.